We all know the effects of severe storms, but when it comes to cleaning up, things can get messy. MTN's Keely Van Middendorp reports on a pair of belt women who'd been in the dark since last week's storm. You couldn't see nothing. It's been nearly a week since a severe storm slammed the Treasure State. Severe weather is striking north central Montana, bringing with it strong winds, hail and rain. We got all these limbs that we got to move. The system caused widespread damage to many areas, including this residence in Belt. The tree is over our propane tank. And while the power was back on for many, we can't do nothing on the stove, nothing in the microwave. The pair of women were still dealing with good? darkness. We have little flashlights. We have to take them back into the bathroom to use the bathroom. Little flashlights. The two used what they called a lifeline, a single extension cord from a nearby building, which served as their only source of power. This is uh, the only reason that we have our refrigerator running. We can't afford to spoil food. Since last week, the pair had been in the middle of yet another storm. Uh, trying to figure out how to get their power back on. It's confusing. And after nearly Here. seven days in the dark. If you want to read a book or, or anything, forget it. The lady said they were told it would be at least another three weeks before power would be restored. They said they had a lot of customers ahead of us. MTN News reached out to Northwestern Energy Company spokesperson Brandy Powers, who told us they'd been aware of the lady's situation. So our local operations team has actually been working with these customers daily. She said while Northwestern Energy is required to install and fix the company's broken poles, customer-owned poles are not their obligation. If the pole has a customer-owned meter base on it, it is a customer's pole. Northwestern does offer reinstallation options to all customers, but their repair schedule dictates when they're able to service a customer-owned pole. Customer has options available to them um, that they can go to other service providers besides Northwestern Energy. And another thing that homeowners and even new homeowners Owners should realize that any meter base directly attached to a power line like this one falls under the homeowner's responsibility, including any wires directly attached from this power line to personal property, whether it be above ground or below. So it can be really complex, and we work with many of our rural customers when these situations occur. Mary tells us that less than 24 oh, yeah. hours after MTN News reached out, yeah. Northwestern Energy and Cascade well, Electric Oops. reinstalled their pole. Powers gives this advice to all homeowners yeah. with power problems who may not know who to call after a summer storm. Our customer contact center is available 24-7. They can also track and report outages online through our online outage map. In Belt, Keely Van Bittendorp, MTN News. That number you can call is 888-467-2669. It's also on your screen, and we have that full story on our website.